<laughs> Welcome back to Insights at the She Shed. I'm Julie Hasowitz with Remax Suburban. I'm Jeannie Gorey, Neighborhood Loans, Money in the Middle. And I'm Jamie Sobranski, Remax Suburban. And what are we doing today, Jeannie? Nothing. See ya. <laughs> no. You can see the she shed over my shoulder here. Yes, we are going to talk about mortgage wire Cheerio. fraud today. Yes, we're going to talk about wire fraud. Yes. 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 Okay. So what is it? So what is it? So wire fraud is a type of real estate fraud that happens when someone tricks you into sending your down payment or money, not to the title company or where it's supposed to go, but to them. And in 2021, $350 million were lost in real estate fraud. So this is a real deal. It really yeah. does happen. It yeah. does happen. And, and you know, how they do this is because, you know, when you're buying a home, sometimes it's a bit stressful, a lot of stuff going on, a lot of stuff to keep track of. So they can get into your account, not into your mortgage account or anything like that, but into your email possibly and figure yeah. out that you are indeed buying a home. So they can then once you get the wiring instructions, they can go into that, send you an email. Looks like it comes from me. It'll have my name on it or it'll have her name or her name on it yeah, saying, right. oh, quick change, urgent. We have to change the wire to this instead of the one that you were predetermined to send yes. to. Yeah, right. So, and it can, so it's a really good idea because these ladies and myself will actually guide you through the process so mm -hmm. you'll know exactly what to yeah. do so that doesn't happen. Yeah. So, and right along with that, so beware of any changes, any last minute changes, like you all of a sudden get this second email, right email. Says, wait a second, we made a mistake, now we want you to send the money to this place. So th that's one yes. way. The other one is make sure and call before you send the wire. Yes, right? call, your really yeah, call, call your title company. Yeah, call your title company. Even if you have the wiring instructions in your hand, go to right. your bank or call your bank, and, but before you go and wire, you're gonna call the title company and go, okay, what are the wiring instructions? Yes. Make sure they match what yes. you have in your hand. And verify. And make yes. sure you have the contact information. It comes from your attorney, it comes from your what? Yeah. From us? Yes. <laughs> that it's not Lender, from some your random, lender, your lender. from a different email. Oh no, call this person to find out the wiring instructions. Mm. And then you want to be verify at the end. Oh, this is a good one. So you want to make sure that let's say you walk into the bank and you go ahead and you wire the money through your bank and they give you a little receipt that says, okay, it's done. done. You need to go home and you need to check your account and make sure the money actually came out of your came account. out of the account and then also yep. call the title company and yes, make sure, sure that it showed up and that they got it and they got it so it's out of your account but make sure it got to the title company yes. it seems like oh my gosh there's so many steps this is going to be really important yeah it's Especially, a lot of money to leave to yes lose, to yes lose and, you, it, yeah. and if it's over if you if your down payment is over fifty thousand dollars it has to be wired so yes. we're talking about a lot of money yeah, yeah, we're a good fund state, so it has to be wired over fifty thousand. But the but the thing is, the advantage of you calling ahead of time to the title company, make sure they receive it. If they didn't, a lot of times we can get within twelve to twenty four hours, we can find the money and get it back. Yes. Not yeah. always, um, right. but sometimes that can happen. So it's really important to check instead yeah. of waiting two days or yes. whatever to see right. if it's there or so, not. And, and check right away. Yeah, you mm -hmm. you go into the bank because you're going to go. I'm going to be safe. I'm going to go directly into the bank to wire the money to yeah. to where it's supposed to go. But go home and check because we recently just had a closing that almost didn't close because you have to have that money at your closing. Yes. So they did a quick, some quick maneuvering yes. and ended up getting the money where we needed it within, within the hands of the title yeah. company. Yes. Yeah. The money goes to the title company. Yes. Right? So really okay. it's verifying in the very beginning with the title company and say, right. hey, I'm going to call you back and make sure that it actually showed up. Right. And that, you know, having so, that contact is good. And, and we're going to remind you. 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 Everybody I'm going to remind you, but just so you know, it's very, very important. Yeah. There you go. That's it. See ya. See you, See you next time. Enjoy your day today.